What is up, everybody? We are back again with some more Tunic. The last time we completed one of the missions, well, what I would consider it to be a mission, which is ringing the East Bell. So we did that. And next, I guess we're going to be going ahead and working on ringing the West Bell. And something cool that we ended up getting was this map of the Overworld. So, it, as you can see there, that's where we can kind of see where we're at as a icon of a fox and we got a map of the underwell under the well as well so i think we're just going to be following along with this checklist of ringing the west bell and we're going to go ahead and head to the old house which looking at it i do see a key icon now that i'm like really looking at it so maybe we can't even enter the old house, so we'll go there. If we can't go there, then we'll go to the flooded well. And as you can see, that's just to the left of us. So something really cool that we ended up getting is this sword. The sword allows us to chop down these like bushes. Whereas before we couldn't go through these bushes, now we can. So now we're going to be able to explore a lot more. Yep. This is part of where we're going to be going. I think right below me is the old house. So I wonder if we are able to enter it or not. But since we're here, I'm curious what's in here. So, what the heck is that? Can I talk to it? What is this? Oh, we have. Oh, I'm gonna take the health, honestly. Okay, well, now we know. Something to come back to. I wonder if I'm gonna tr test, like, exiting and then coming back. Right there you can see that's where the bell is that we can go ahead and ring okay go ahead and head down now so we try to come in here yeah it's locked Oh yeah, the sword is so much better than just the stick. It doesn't even compare. So what's this saying? Hmm, I think this is kind of like you the difference between blocking. So if you block. You get some stamina taken away, I think. But if you're flashing red, you're vulnerable, right? So. Oh, so it's, it, yeah, it's just showing you the difference between if you have stamina and if you don't have stamina. If you don't have stamina, you take way more damage, 50% more damage. Not able to block. Stability is low. 
special tech. I don't know what, exactly what that means. So, oh, oh. Yeah, good to know. Treasure and tools. We see the bomb on there. Very interesting. Seems like the sword is going to be the best item that we can get in terms of weapon. Say that if you throw enough bombs, you'll get a prize, so don't be afraid to use them. What it says at the bottom. Okay. See this thing. We like. It does nothing. wanted to see over here if there was anything. Oh shoot, I didn't even see this guy. Yeah, there we go. We got a chest. Another piece of that broken shell looking thing. I think we're gonna go ahead and enter the well. That seems to me like that's the next step. We, it doesn't look like we could technically go further down on the map. But let's just go ahead and enter the well. Oh, I can't. It's not the... Oh no, the well is up top. Sorry, I know I'm going back and forth, but... It looks to me like the well is actually like the entrance is down here somewhere. If we take a look at the map, it says well under the well. And then it says in at the very bottom. That does look like the map. Alright, so then let's just keep going down. I don't know what you want to call those things, but I'm just going to call them coins for now. Hey, there we go. We got some bombs. Okay. So we'll see how the bombs work. Like, I wonder if I can throw them? Oh yeah, there we go. <laughs> hey, that was pretty good. Clearly, you're supposed to wait for their attack and then go in. Because your shield will block your attack. Oh, dang. This is under the well. This has to be it. 
Oh, t nope. <laughs> this is just a door. Oh, shoot. if I can hit these things. Oh. That makes sense. So now we know that these like turret things are all spread out on this map. Or at least they were. No. Where we see kind of like those bells, then we know that that's where there was a turret before. I am debating if I should try even if I should even try attacking this thing. Oh yeah, there's a key right there. We're gonna have to. Interesting that it doesn't attack us. Oh, here we go. Wait, no. <laughs> What's this? Where does this lead? Thirty-two, page thirty-two. But it does look like this game might be bigger than what I, even what I thought. Here we go. Maybe not. That seems to be like some type of invisible path. The chest. There we go. Oh man, really? We now we gotta make it back. Right now, it kind of just seems like we're exploring. We haven't entered any specific area yet. Oh shit. Did I come down here already? Oh, nope. That's not gonna happen. There's no way. It's 
Slippers? Can I put slippers on? Oh, okay. I thought, I thought those were slippers. Alright, there's only one thing to do here now. Yep, I thought. I figured as much. His attacks. Damn. Um. He's guarding this thing heavy. We got three of these bad boys. Oh, we can purchase more. Alright, we'll buy more just in case. We got nine. That should be enough, right? I don't see how that wouldn't be enough. this on a different path okay okay what the hell is this <laughs> It's like some type of like power source. Ah, okay, so this is how we get this chest over here. And that's about it. Or actually no. So where are we now? Okay. This is fine. I'm cool with exploring this area real quick. Oh, we're just looping back. Okay, okay. close one. Alright, let's see. What can we do with this thing? Oh. I kind of just wasted that. Okay. Now it's time. Oh, 
Oh yeah. That's the key to the old house. So we should be good. I think we've essentially explored everything that we could other than the old house. We got another chest in here. What? That was it? No, I don't believe it. Okay. Oh, nice, nice. Looks like just an innocent little old house, but in reality, got some mysteries to it. We finally got a shield now. Where are we now? Oh, I see. We're by the sealed temple just to the left. Do it over here. Wait, what? Oh, uh, yeah, there, I guess there was no way we would have known this, right? It does look like we're we are going to the well. Or the dark dark tomb. One of the two. Is, but it kind of looks like we have to like light it up. But yeah, I think we have to go in here. All right, so we are here in the dark tomb. Okay, I now see why they call it the dark here. Oh, no, no, no. Hell no. No, I'm stuck. Yes, okay. That would have sucked. I would have hated to have to come back to get my... Coins. You know what? I'm not going to call them coins. I'm, call them, I'm going to call them rupees. In honor of Zelda, and clearly, clearly, this game takes uh, some inspiration from Zelda. Yeah, I, I have a feeling we're gonna get some type of like magic ability or something where we're gonna be able to see, like, have fire, like some type of light. That's where everything is pointing me to. What does this say? Danger. Peppers? Maybe those things? We test this out. Ooh. Wait, let's try that again. 
Uh, I do take, I do take some damage. Oh no, I don't. I only take. It only takes away from my stamina. That's pretty crazy. At least from this enemy. And then probably once I run out of stamina is when, obviously, I can't use my shield. Let's test it out. Yeah, I can't use my shield when I don't have any stamina. There's gonna be a turret right there, huh? Yep. Oh, but. Shoot. So, let's just take a look at the booklet here. I just wanted to show where I'm getting the inspiration from. Wait, what? I could have sworn... Hold on. Oh, so the auto bolts? There, it says... It wants to protect something, but what? Circle around it and use the shield. So... Tip, use the shield, and you can block those, you know, these things. I wonder if I can, like, okay, so I can't return them. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. Jesus. Oh my god. Dude, I am fucked. Oh, maybe not, maybe not. Let's do this first. Oh my god. Dude, that thing is ruthless. <laughs> Dude, look the right fucking way. What the hell? Why is he looking the other way? Dude, the shield is trash. What does this thing do? I don't, I don't know what that does. Well, I'm fucked. I'm gonna die again. <laughs> It. Let's not even try getting what's behind it. Okay, so we're getting gaining a little bit more insight. You seek to increase your power. Attack is the tooth thing. Defense is like a fox looking thing. HP is heart. Ocean is whatever that is. Three mystery. Okay. Oh. Garden Knight. So it looks like the Garden Knight is going to be the next boss. You can do it. That's why it says to be try to be this strong. Attack and defense. Oh. 
Oh, and it's um, referring to on the bottom right, right there, you can see I have like a tooth, the potion thing, and the flower. So that's what we use. I was wondering what that was for. So we use that to go ahead and upgrade our character. Where does where does this lead? We've been here. Yeah. So okay. Now we've kind of like looped back around. So let's see. See now we can. Oh, who? There it is. So this is. Take a look at this again. Attack. HP. Okay. Ah oh, shit, I didn't mean to do that, but whatever. So, we can offer it. Alright, we actually have enough for all of these things, so do all of them. Wrong button again. Potion? So, by this, I'm pretty sure what it means is that any of the, like, the health potions that we use is just going to be increased. It'll increase more of our health per potion. here. I wonder if I should have that. I could pretty much die and I would be okay with it since we're so close. I wonder if I should try to take this thing out now. To worry about it. Beneath the well. Clearly, we're right here. No, oh, sorry, not right there. Yeah, right here, under the well. Sky here. Yeah, I mean, this place doesn't seem that big, so I mean, go ahead and try to clear it out. And I like to refer to this thing just to... Uh, I think it's cool that it gives us this. The Swarm is a type of slime who just wants to be close to you. Stun it by blocking. See? Nice. Okay. I think I should have said that it blows up too, but whatever. that is oh man I wish we could like run faster right here This is another map. Oh look, so now we can learn a little bit more about Envoy. More questions than answers. 
Just because they're mysterious, I guess. I guess let's go ahead and see if there's anything underneath this waterfall. Oops, there is. Oh yeah, that's super cool. It even marks you where you're at here. So yeah, once you know how to deal with those guys, it is not... It, they're super easy. Right here. Let's check what's back here. What's this light again? Like I said, this light seems, seems to be like some type of like energy source. What it seems like. right here. And the turrets are the worst. Definitely heal up. It's this thing. Oh shit. Oh no no no. That's not gonna happen. Oh fuck. I guess I can do this though.
So I got that to the recommended amount. So clearly, wait, no, actually, see something. Ah, there we go. Okay. And there's like those monsters in there, those like tentacle things. And I thought maybe they'd be like guarding something, but it doesn't really seem like there's anything else in there. Right here. No? Yes. Okay, so we created this shortcut. Now we can go back this way. Okay, cool. So I got one of those items. I forget what that does. What does that one do? Oh, it increases my defense. Okay, cool. Obviously, once I upgrade it. Oh shit, oh shit. Oh, fuck. Damn, I fucked up. I think it's doing. Oh, here it comes. Oh shit. Let's see what that is also. It does say that there's like a boss or something over here. Yep, there it is. So like on the map, it has like that skull. That obviously was not the boss. Oh. Under the well and beneath the earth. this might as well oh is this back at the tomb But you, it does say that you can get a lantern. Oh, wait. Aha. 
get this. Damn. Backed it. So, pretty much. We didn't face any boss or anything. But what we did is, off this checklist, we did the old house and we did the flooded well. And we got the lantern so now we can do the dark tomb, the west garden, and whatever is after that. But yeah, so I'm really liking the direction that this game is going, honestly. Like the difficulty, the different items that we're getting now, the lantern. Now we can explore dark areas. Um, the upgrade ability is really cool. I was expecting something like that, but I didn't know when it was going to happen. But now that it's happening, taking you know taking the game to another level, I would say. Um, and yeah, I like that it lets you explore, but there's still kind of like a concrete path that you need to take for the game. You know, it's obviously not like an open world game or anything like that. It, you have boundaries, you need certain items to access new areas. Um, and I think it's doing a really good job of, of that, honestly. And the uh, still enjoying this like booklet that you get. Uh, you kind of like collect pages of it and it's kind of like putting together this booklet of how the game works. Uh, I think it's a really cool concept. But yeah, next time we'll do the Dark Tomb and hopefully we'll clear the Ringing the West Bell quest or mission. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please like and subscribe. And peace.